Welcome to Crap Art. It's uh, almost 11 in the morning on Saturday, March 14th. Second day of Crap Art. Uh, the first day went e extremely well. There, it was like uh, pretty much an explosion or an earthquake. Actually, I would say it was more like an earthquake. Because there typhoon! Was no, an earthquake. Okay. But yeah, typhoon. <laughs> what happened was like there was this big explosion at first and then like, uh, like just at the beginning there were so many people up here you couldn't move. And then afterwards, you know, just people kept coming, and like, so they were like the aftershocks. But anyways, uh, crap. Mm. So, um, if you take a look inside, you see this, this floor is all covered, mostly dirt. But like, this was all white before. There was nothing on this before at the beginning of the night, and now it's all just completely covered. Like, there's stuff that looks like blood. If you take a look at over there. Uh, over the there's a blood trail that leads to a gun sitting in a pile of guts. Oh, crap. Alright, so what room should we look at first? The cool room? No, okay. let's start with the cool yeah. room. Well, all of them are cool rooms. Anyway, alright, so take a look at this room. Uh, just pan over and touch. Okay. So look at this room. Like, uh, once again, I can't stress this enough. Cover. Like, this is just completely covered. None of this was here before. People just sat in here. This was a very chill room. People just sat in here and just drew. Drew on the walls, drew on everything, sat, sat on the floor and drew. And, uh, you know, it's, it's really neat because there were Koreans and foreigners in here just working together. Uh, and take, if you take a look at this piece, this piece was, uh, was made, like, just like, it took so much time to make this piece, and like, uh, she was here all, all night, and it looks awesome. And, you know, it's, it has a good message. Spew out your worries. I love it. And as you can see, there's an umbrella hanging on the wall. Uh, they use some of our crap art posters. The moon and the sun. And this girl has uh, drawn her life in a collage form. Food, fantasy, fashion, love, guys, and travel, and then just apples, everything. So let's move on. Keep on rocking. Keep on rolling. Nice shoes, man. Oh, thanks. All right, now the sculpture room. Let's do it. Oh, get under this doorway. Oh, careful of the string. And as you can see, this was all just like trash and clay. Beautiful face. Mm -hmm. uh, with nice everything, accessories. Uh, tape that we found. Most of, the, most of this we found, uh, except for the clay. And it turns out to be pretty good. You know, they used old Korean books to decorate. And this, this sculpture I do kind of like. You know, it's, it's real to me. Uh, if you can understand what I mean, but you know, peop this was not as uh, I don't know if people were in here as much as the other rooms, yeah. but this certainly is as worked as the other rooms. I really like all of it. Oh, so let's go back under the sculpture dome and. Let's go into this random room. But first, I want you to take a look at this hint. Hint. I tried to create something profound. Profound. Oh, yeah, it does say profound. Go figure. Your guitar! That was my guitar. <laughs> it's still my guitar. Right? Oh, man. But take a look at all this art. This, was, this room was worked on a whole night. And uh, that was my amp. This. This sculpture right here, if you take a look at this one, this kind of cesarean one, uh, that took this girl a long time to do. Like she just spent all a long time just like wrapping the string, and it turned like it's just very uh, stark. And this one over here, I love it. She uh, she finished this halfway through the night, and uh, you know it's. It's beautiful the way it is. I don't. I don't want anyone to paint over it. But uh, you know, it probably like it probably will be. You know, in years come. 
And it's hard case. Be happy. Good. Let's see. Keep going. Here's some pretty cool art that two guys just sat down and drew. And into the paper room. There you go. Here in the paper room, we have a lot of stuff. One of the features we can see is writings done by Craig Mason. He wrote these things on uh, pretty nice paper and just left them for anyone to do. Anyone to do anything they wanted to. So he painted circles and attached it to the wall. Someone else painted real neon colors and pretty sweet stuff on there. And this room has just, it, everything is all random, but it seems to all work together. There actually seems to be a little bit of a flow going around the room. It's good. Don't you think so, Josh? Love it. Love it. And this butterfly uh, is all made out of toilet paper. Hugey. It's really good. And the painting room. Let's go in the painting room. Once again, all white before. Uh, this is a Sarah DeVillo original. Uh, it's going, it's all dry now, and it's going to be uh, cut up and made a diptych. And uh, this is finger painting by uh, friends of Sarah DeVillo. And let's see, these paint cans, they're still full. <laughs> we have, we've used all this paint and it's still full. So. Uh, yeah, we got, we're pro we're gonna have enough for another show, hopefully. So moving on, moving on to random room number two. And this one's really nice. The girls who made the butterfly on the hall made this gum sculptures, uh, and it's called action sticking. They took hot water and just stuck gum everywhere. And there's some nice drawings that people did at the beginning of the night. Really nice. Uh, and let's see, just drawings on the wall. This was a really good room to work with because it was just completely black. Uh, so you can do anything. And Paul here drew these drew these figures at the beginning of the night. And they did, you know, they did pretty good, I would say. Uh, the girl who worked on this chair. Was, was here all night, just just sitting here drawing, drawing, and gluing, and sticking, listening to her tunes and jamming out. And these girls, uh, they did, okay, okay, they did, they did, just worked on these all night once again. But they turned out to be really good. So I think that's it for that part. Uh, what we have, and this is only halfway through the whole thing. So. Please, finish.